I want to dig in yeah. to this final season of Barry. Yes. We're oh my God. Barry watchers. We've been watching from the beginning. Yes. I still don't even know how it's going to end. I don't even know how I feel about it ending. I, don't I mean, know, I'm not happy about I don't it. Know but how I, I don't know how I want it to end. I know. That is a good question. I'm, I've given that up because this is Bill Hader's season. Oh, for he is, sure. He has directed all eight episodes, plus produce and write and act. He is my acting partner, along with everything else he does in the show. I don't know because I'm not in those other pods. I don't know what's happening <gasps> when I'm not there. They keep it very secret. And he keeps it very secret. We saw the end of the show two weeks ago for the first time. Oh, like all the cast and crew got together, did a screening Well, the, type the thing. crew was there and two cast members. Everybody else was scattered. So do you watch it in, in real time? Like I do. You don't know what's happening with NoHo Hank. And do no. you watch it in real time? I watch it and... in real time. And even if I have seen some of the episodes before, because I had to do ADR, I had yeah. to correct sound mistakes. Uh, when you piece it all together, it is mind-bending. Did you like it when they dressed you up like an Old Testament god for the for the uh, <laughs> like flash Moses. forward? Well, you know what? After the uh, it, well, last night it was revealed that I escaped to Israel after having shot my son by mistake. Yes, and I worked on a kibbutz, yeah, where I helped other people build houses and became a great person. <laughs> <laughs> so that was. How, t g give us your take on Gene, because I, to me, the thing that defines Gene is that when he decided to tell his story to, to Vanity Fair, which is your friend. Yes, Patrick Fischler, yeah, Patrick who we Fischler. love. Isn't he great? He's incredible. The old friend of Julius. Yeah, we Patrick. love him. Um, but yeah, you act out your entire like life <laughs> you, story. What happened you know? when he started speaking German? <laughs> I know. Okay, so we're, now the rehearsals. Uh, are not our uh, read throughs with just the scene you're in. And so he was there. Uh, and uh, I think that he ate Skittles, uh, right? Uh, during, the, yeah, during, the uh, during the scenes, right? And then all of a sudden, as he was approached by, uh, by Jim uh, Moss, the, the, the detective, he had a nervous breakdown and went to. German gummy bears, and it was his idea. Oh wow! In the room. Oh, that was so funny. So that was smart. Patrick's idea. I love that. Well, I love that it's like very apparent, especially in these last few episodes, that Barry, Sally, yourself, Gene, Noho, Hank—they're all so desperate to rewrite their history, yes, right, right. and ignore right. who yeah. they were, what they were, which is why I think it's so fascinating that I like. With two episodes left, I don't know how it's going to end. Yeah. Right. Because how can you successfully do that? You know what? I, uh, that happened at the end of every episode, uh, of, of every season, I should say. I always thought they have just written themselves into a corner. How are they going to get out? And they always do. And Bill and Alec, uh, Bill's uh, co-creator, Alec Berg, they promised us from the very beginning, we will never repeat. We will never duplicate ourselves. So uh, they kept their word because I myself am uh, in constant shock by what's going on. What can you tell us about what happens with Gene? Oh, I can tell you that Gene wants so badly to rewrite his history, totally. to redeem himself. And I, I wonder if that hasn't been the overall umbrella of the last two seasons, redemption, and yeah. whether or not you can be redeemed. <laughs> 